Hey YouTubers, this is WeTreef. I'd like to welcome you back to my channel. Today we'll be digging into Janet Jackson's 2000 MTV Video Music Awards performance of Doesn't Really Matter from the Nutty Professor 2, The Clump soundtrack. But before we get started, here are some fast facts. These facts for Doesn't Really Matter are courtesy of Billboard magazine, long considered the music industry's Bible. As you see here, the Doesn't Really Matter single was certified gold in the United States with sales of over half a million copies. The song, Janet's Ninth Number One, stayed atop the Hot 100 for three weeks and made her the very first artist in music history to have number one singles in three consecutive decades. She would later extend to a fourth decade with number ones in 2010 and 2015. Doesn't Really Matter also reached number three on Billboard's Hot R&B, Hip Hop Songs Chart, and experienced success abroad with top 10 placements in Canada, Italy, Denmark, and the UK. And it ended the year 2000 as the overall 18th most popular song on the Hot 100. Not too bad. Well, enough of that. Let's get to the performance.
Let's talk about what I loved about that performance. First of all, let me say that, as usual, Miss Jackson killed it. She's proven time and time again that she's a peerless, um, she's peerless among other performers. Not to say that they're not other great performers, but she makes it look effortless, and she's clearly been an inspiration to many of today's performers, regardless of genre or gender. All right, let's talk about the choreography. I thought it was outstanding, and for that we have to give props to Marty Kodelka. In addition to choreographing this performance, he also choreographed Janet Jackson's video, the original video for Doesn't Really Matter. He's also choreographed for a lot of other artists, including Justin Timberlake, J-Lo, Jason Derulo, Mariah Carey, Robin Thicke, Joe Jonas, and the list goes on and on and on. I thought his choreography was rugged, it was fresh, and it was extremely well executed by Janet and her dancers. Was there anything I didn't like about this performance? Well, I must admit, in the beginning, I had a problem with the lighting. While dynamic, it was really hard to see Janet because it was blocking her out. Thankfully, it didn't last long and we got to see her. Um, the other thing that I didn't like as much was the wardrobe and the makeup choice. It was rather dark and kind of gothic, and it was just not the Janet Jackson that we're used to seeing, um, glamorous and flawless. But I'm thinking that they, that may have been intentional, that they may have been trying to match the theme of the song, which is about not caring as much about appearance and the physical, but more about what's inside. So if that's the, the case, I totally understand. But overall, I thought it was a remarkable performance and very well done. I want to know what your thoughts are. Please leave your comments below. Let me know what you liked about the performance and what you didn't like about the performance. Also, please feel free to subscribe to this channel. I have much more content. I have plenty more performances in my vault. If there's anything you'd like me to look for or to talk about in the future, please let it be known in the comments. Until then, I hope you have a wonderful day, and remember that God loves you and me.